Ladies and gentlemen, at this time we ask that Thousands of people across the United States have been marking the first anniversary of the Boston Marathon bombing. A minute silence was observed to mark the time when the first explosion rocked the city. Following the ceremony, the crowd walked down Boylston Street, the final stretch of the race. The U.S. Vice President Joe Biden led tributes to the victims and survivors of the attack, which left three people dead and 264 others injured. And it infuriates them that we refuse to bend, refuse to change, refuse to yield to fear. What makes me so proud to be an American is that we have never, ever, ever yielded to fear. The bombing was the largest mass casualty attack on U.S. soil since September the 11th. One of the two ethnic Chechen brothers suspected of planting a device was killed in a shootout three days later. The other is awaiting trial on charges that will carry the death penalty if he's convicted. Get out of the zone. Get out of the zone.